This is the beginning of my aquaponics project. Um, I will be taking this container, pulling it out, cleaning it up. After that, we'll chop this portion off, flip it over. The top will become a grow bed. The bottom will be the tank container for the tilapia that I'll be growing. And the first step is to get these arms off. There are two arms like this that secure the tank in place, and they are, they contain the, or they, use T40 star style nuts so you'll need to get that uh, drill bit to take those off and they secure right here this is the last one and then the arm pulls right out once we've done that we'll take the tank out clean it up and get started on the project so at this point the tanks are clean and I've set the tanks back into the cages. What I've done that's a little bit different from the other versions of this setup is that I chopped it one level higher um, and kept more tank so that I could have more volume for more fish. Um, what that does though is it leaves an unfinished edge up here. So this is more of a proof of concept right now than anything just to kind of finish the edges with the PVC and I'll be getting the elbows later. They serve no function other than to finish these ends. Um, so this will be my grow bed. Now I've got to work on the drain and pumping systems, but at this point you got an idea. We've taken this portion, flipped it over, and turned it 180 degrees. Reattach the support arms underneath for additional stability, and that's where we're at. For my grow medium, I chose Hydroton. Here I'm washing out the grow medium, and what I've got is an old recycling bin that has holes in it, and then I've lined it with screening so that none of the pebbles in the growing medium falls through. And then I just spray the hell out of it and uh, hope it gets clean enough. My system is done at this point and um, made a couple mistakes along the way and fixed those. So now we have a flood recirculating system and you can see here we've got the pump down there in the bottom that pumps up back here directly into the bed and we'll be kind of working that out a little bit more um, to make sure that I've got some physical filtration. And then down here we've got a one inch standpipe um, so that we get good flow down into the tank and some good aeration as well. Right now I'm sitting at, and it's kind of hard to see the water line here, sitting at 150 gallons. And I'm uh, probably going to bring that up a little bit higher, closer to the 175 range. But uh, all in all, pretty happy. Um, for the most part, I got the, the media pretty well washed. I only have a little bit of sediment down there. So all in all, I'm pretty, pretty happy with the way things turned out.